Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to my channel. In this episode, a very high anticipated one. It's the Hypers module. Let's go. The Hypers module is designed to sharpen your image while using different blend modes. It has two different sliders. The first one is the sharpness slider, which adds sharpness to the image. The second slider is the contrast boost slider, which adds more contrast to your image. In this case, we have a fairly flat and non-speaking image and the high pass module will change that for us. Once the module is being activated, the image turns black and white with contrast and sharpness still being there. If you increase the value on the sharpness slider by moving it to the right, more sharpness will be introduced. If you move it to the left, the value decreases and so does the sharpness. The same principle applies to the contrast boost slider. To the right means that more contrast will be introduced into the image and to the left means that the amount of contrast will be decreased. Let's click on the uniformly button and change the blend mode from normal to soft light. I will now deactivate the module so you guys can see a quick before and after. So here's a before image which looks a bit dull and flat and now when I activate it you see the values being applied to the image. It immediately changes how the image looks. Now let me move the sliders around to show you guys how it looks when we move the sliders around a little bit while having the image visible with the blend mode on soft light. I'm going to put the sharpness around 65% and the contrast boost around 38%. What you can do as well is move the opacity slider to increase or decrease the strength of the high pass module output. Now to finish this off let me show you guys a quick before and after. Here we have a before image and here we have an after. Much better if you ask me. And that's it. I hope you guys like it. Let me know in the comment section down below. If you want to see more of me, please click uh, that playlist over there. And if you haven't subscribed already, you can do so by clicking uh, that button over there. And for this week, there's only one more thing left for me to say, which is make love to the like button. And until next time, doei!